Hello, scientists. Good morning. As you can see that this is not the room that I am typically in. I'm traveling in Taiwan right now. There's a big earthquake that just happened while I'm on the island. Who would have thought? I totally did not plan this. Uh, the earthquake is really bad on the east side of the island. Multiple buildings collapsed. There were also bridges breaking down and uh, landslides. That too. So uh, a lot of things is going on right now while I am visiting. It's just an insane coincidence. I also bought some new plants, especially not this space to make it more lively. This is a banana plant. It's quite big. Really cute. Do you guys like my new banana plant? Some of the leaves are out of frame. There's a firm at the back. Maybe it's called a nest firm. Let me check right now. It is my favorite firm. It is really delicious. The species name is Aspleni Asplenium nidus. The common name is bird nest plant. It is really delicious. The sprout. Cut it off and stir fry it with some dry small fish. One of the most delicious vegetable dish. Unfortunately, you cannot find it in Europe. It can only tolerate temperature that's over 10 degrees. So it will definitely die in the winter in Europe. They like to grow in between the trees, a little intersection between two branches. The shape of the leaf is for collecting raindrops. Love it, also very delicious. So what is this big announcement I want to tell you guys about? I have opened a new channel that is only about Adobe Illustrator. The channel's name is Drawbalmet Illustrator and I will be posting Adobe Illustrator tutorials. On top of that, I will also include tips and tricks of using this graphic design software. The reason I'm doing this is that I did a survey asking you guys which software you use. 37% of you guys use Adobe Illustrator. The rest of the people use Inkscape and PowerPoint combined. I have a scientist background, so I like to analyze statistics and data. It means that a lot of you guys have Adobe Illustrator subscriptions, either through your own budget or through the institution that you are working at. Almost 60% of the viewers on this channel don't have access to Adobe Illustrator. They will use Inkscape and PowerPoint instead. So what has been happening throughout the two years that I'm building this channel is that I first started with Adobe Illustrator tutorials. A lot of people would start to ask me, where can you get Adobe Illustrator for free? Can you use a crack version of the Adobe Illustrator and they draw this structure in Inkscape? That is why I started to make Inkscape tutorials. Then I saw a trend in the YouTube data. People who use Adobe Illustrator will not watch the tutorials in Inkscape and vice versa. It seems that it creates a confusing viewing experience for you guys. A lot of you will be waiting for other Illustrator tutorials and it turns out that uh, it is in Inkscape, then you will not watch it. That is why I decided to make a new channel that is only about other Illustrator. Go subscribe to the channel. I will start posting there once I get back to the Netherlands. Or if you guys like this setup, I can also start creating content here. Like, What do you guys think? Is this good enough? When I don't have my professional equipment, I am a little bit insecure about producing videos. I'm literally filming on my phone right now. Let me know if this looks good to you. And a different thing about the Joe Bauman Illustrator channel is that I will be selling you courses there. I actually have made an online course. It is a beginner course for scientists who want to use other Illustrator to draw schematic scientific illustrations. But I've been really reluctant to promote a course on this channel. This channel is really like hanging out with you guys. If I start selling the course here, I don't feel very comfortable. It's a little bit like using the friendship to get benefit. Then you'll get this the multi-layer marketing vibe, you know, like when people are selling essential oils, that kind of stuff, they use their social circle to promote their MLM business. I don't want to bring that vibe to this channel, but on the other channel, Drawbow Math Illustrator, I will start selling your courses. I will shove it down your throat like it's the best food that you ever had. Buy it, buy it, buy it. I know for those of you who subscribe to that channel want to learn other Illustrator and I've made a really good course for you so it will be a disservice not to promote it to you. Also, other Illustrator is a paid software. I would assume the people who are using it have the budget to buy my course. That will be the house rule of the new channel and I'm really excited about it. The vibe will be completely different from here. Here I'm more relaxed. I share more about my personal 
personal life, I experiment different contents. Last week, I posted a video about digital painting. I will continue to make Inkscape tutorials here because I want to create these open source resources so you guys can use it to make figures for your research publications. I've been doing the scientific illustration business for over two years. I have clients from all around the world. What I noticed is that clients in the North American countries have the most budget. But clients from Europe and clients from Asia, they don't have that scale of budget. That's something that really concerns me. My American clients told me that if you're submitting to high impact journals, they now expect you to have a really professional figures. The quality of the graphical abstract is starting to affect the result of the reviewing decision. I'm really worried for the scientists who do not work at the well-funded institutions, the labs who don't have massive budget. They might lose competitiveness while trying to publish their paper Usually, you don't have a training for drawing professional scientific illustration at your PhD program. There's not enough resources out there. You guys really need these resources to help you make good figures. All right, so that is the announcement about this new channel. Let me know in the comments what you want to see on this channel and also that channel. Go follow Joe Bauman Illustrator and I will see you there.